What the fuck is this? This better not be something sick, you fucking pieces of fucking garbage. Do you understand? I'm not fucking joking around. This better not be... <sighs> Viewer discretion is advised, folks, okay? Because, you know, I, I don't know what the hell's about to happen here. Put the PC shot on. I stood on the bathroom counter, naked, with my back to the mirror, my hands spreading my ass cheeks so far open, my anus actually felt strained. My legs held a wide stance, and my ears between them with my head between my knees, staring in awe at the upside-down reflection of my beautiful shit winker. It was red to bring cool to and see the kind of fan fiction is this? A few spray dinkle berries were clinging to my long anal tubes, a result of an animal of... wiping. I loosened the grip of my right ass cheek, freeing one hand, then using it to circle the rim of my anus with my index finger in a somewhat tickling fashion. My my asshole flexed from the sudden and titillating sensation, involuntarily retracting in an almost twinkling gesture. What? I giggled, then farted, expecting to see some kind of cartoon-like green fumes or brown bubble, but what instead the fuck just watching my little shit? pucker momentarily expand and reveal, returning to its natural form. You're amazing, I whispered. My wife sat on the nearby toilet, stopping with her head Dude, in her this hand. Is sick fucking the recent infatuation with my own sphincter was putting a strain on our relationship, one that admittedly wasn't going to be quickly remedied by any form therapy. I want to be honest with you, I don't like this. Not just some cheap form of bleeding love or passing human desire. This was a deep and enchanting emotion from the soul. I don't like My this shit. was the most beautiful thing I've ever encountered. My wife realized this and couldn't cope with her recent feelings of worthlessness. Anything we once had was gone dash my divine sphincter taking its place. Jesus Christ. She sobbed. Dude, this is a fanfic of me. This is a fanfic. of my gorgeous Kurt Canal, moaning as my cock began to stiffen. I can't believe I'm forced to watch this. I can't believe that I'm forced to watch this. As my body clenched with orgasmic delight dash of aversion so divine. How can you flaunt your mistress in front of me like this? Dude, how long is this fucking shit? She cried to desperately. Her lust cracker and her fading beauty now meaningless to me seemed to die a little more. She Dude, how long is this shit? My bewitching brown oval consuming my this soul with a high like no other. Lusting for just one kiss with my poop shoot, I pulled my one finger kiss from my ass, shit. tasting it with sensual delight. The sour, pungent taste of diesel matter brought my cock to a complete and raging heart on dash, pulsating with every excited heartbeat. I'm sorry, Smacking folks. My lips, You're in, I say you guys are embarrassing me with Andy Worski over here, you know that? We got subcultured listening, and you guys are fucking embarrassing me with this bullshit. Hold my ass cheeks open while I jack up, I order. I want to see my asshole and I come. She screamed in complete distress. The hurt in her voice matched. I'm sorry to subcultured who's being who's listening right now. My apologies, man. These are my fans, by the way. These are my fucking fans. While furiously masturbating with my other hand, angels sang as I began building to your orgasm, moans of enchanting ecstasy echoing off the bathroom walls. My eyes crossed as I screamed. I almost did. Hold on. It's almost done. I thought I almost saw something there. Sorry about that. My wife pleaded. My strokes became more divine to master. I'm sorry y'all had to hear this, dude. I'm sorry. Once again, somebody donated $20.20. Oh, God. She cried. How can I owe you a tremendous warm filled me as my cock fits wide gravy and immense systematic spurts. I continued really fingering my asshole, stimulating my prostate, enhancing the sexual euphoria what? as my steaming cock shot thick man juice across the bathroom, clinging in long, mucilaginous... I mean, hurry up and hand long. already, for my fuck's sake, man! Feeling the full force of the powerful quake. Right, the light faded as right. I fell into a world of unconsciousness, basking in the comfort of my newfound love. And the endless pleasure of an All right, absolute it's almost done. Jesus fucking Christ. 
I can't believe that I actually sat here and listened to a disgusting, scat-ridden, fucking uh, fanfic about me, all right? Whoever the fuck ghost is an anti-pandemite, I hope you fucking burn in hell, you piece of shit, all right? Seriously, I hope you burn in hell. I hope you get prostate of the fucking, or, or excuse me, uh, uh, cancer of the prostate and the sphincter. I'm even fucking stumbling and mumbling my own fucking words, man. I'm telling you, I've already been on for six hours, no breaks, listening and being subjected to this bullshit. My fans, by the way, I just want everybody to know, these are my fans, by the way. All right, who the hell else do we have here? The next dono is Jay Lawrence. And Jay Lawrence said the following, you won't be able to feel your sides after this one. I don't fucking like that, dude.